Right guys, so a quick video today and I'm going to show you how to get a color grade like Sam Calder with this image here and I'm going to explain a few things about what you should look for as well. So I'm going to start by bringing up the contrast, bringing up the highlights, bringing up the shadows a lot. and really bringing down those blacks. As you can see, he has a lot of really dark blacks. And we're gonna leave clarity and saturation for now. A bit of an S curve. But we are leaving the black point down. He doesn't have much fade in his blacks there, quite true black. Lift the highlights a little. Yep, and moving on to HSL. So we're gonna bring our hues to more of an orange. Yellows, greens. You can leave purple and magenta. Now saturation. I'm going to come down to blues because that's annoying me. Bring it way down. Bring down the reds. Probably the number one thing people get wrong when they do the teal and orange look is they oversaturate greens. Going down to luminance, really bringing down the reds. Orange can stay there, bringing up the yellows for a real pop. Greens can stay there, and we're bringing in our blues, because as you can see, they are very, very bright. And then when you take the luminance out of, out of colors, it deepens them. So now we've got a deeper blue. Now, split toning. So, as you can see, if you're looking real closely, his whites aren't true white. The white of the car isn't actually white. It's got a bit of a warm cast to it. Yellowy, reddish cast. It's very slight, only some people would notice it. Shadows. And just a bit of blue in the shadows. bit now coming down to this important part so we're going to slide this across to 50 down 10 saturation so a lot of people will do this all the way to the end and you lose all your colors he still keeps some greens some oranges and some yellows in those so bring it to 50 you'll get a good teal and orange look but still keep those colors. And grain, don't need grain, don't need to transform. I'm gonna enable profile corrections, and yeah, we're done. So you can see before and after. We could take that down a tad. And then just if you 
you don't need to do this step but if you wanted to make it look a little more like his photo you could darken up that road for him and even add in a bit of light coming from this direction would look good That's if you wanted to do that. But Sam's photo doesn't have it, so I'm just gonna delete it. So I think that looks pretty similar. And that's it guys, so comment down below if you like these short videos or if you prefer the longer ones or who else you want to see and thanks for listening leave a like and i'll see you in the next one